Homebay Brewery. Hello, Brewtubers, and thanks for tuning in again on Homebay Brewery's channel. A previous video on my channel showed you that I purchased a lot of SS Brewtech products with a huge discount for my Conical Fermenter. There's only one big downside of discount prices on that kinds of products. It will be get out of stock very, very soon. One subscriber of my YouTube channel noticed that I have two sets of the extension legs. So one set too many. He asked me if he can buy it from me and I sent it over to him and he's very happy with the extra with my extra set so he, because he ordered almost like the same products like mine but the extension legs were already out of stock so unfortunately for him it was out of stock but lucky for him I had an extra pair an extra set I had some issues with getting a SS Brutec controller holder. I like to have some kind of a holder that uh, holds my SS Brutec uh, FTSS controller. I have to say, you have a stainless steel version that goes right on top of the uh, TC clamp that you clamp on the port. I will show you. So you have a stainless steel version of it, original from Master Brutec. It's like this clamp with a stainless steel plate on it with some uh, shapes and it will hold the Master Brutec temperature controller. You have also some versions of a version with, uh, that's made out of plastic. And I came to an idea, both products were out of stock. And I'm not sure I can buy it again here in uh, the Netherlands. I made, made some prototypes of the plastic version myself. It's not a copy, it's not copyrighted. It's just as you can see now, me on a computer with some uh, 3D print software and 3D design software making a product that will fit my controller on it. I made several prints. Here I have one solid version. This one fits really nice. This cube, hollow cube, will fit to one leg. I will show you right now. Well, this is the idea. You remove the wheels, you put a controller plate, plate on it, like this. Controller fits really nice, can go anywhere, and it looks really nice to me. Cable of the temperature sensor is still long enough, you can put it on top or directly in the stock thermal well. This guy looks to me very neat. Oh, give me your opinion. How does it look? Looks pretty nice, doesn't it? It's pretty steady, but this is the solid version. I will show you that I also designed and printed, 3D printed. Our other version. Printer is finished. I switched it off. It's off now. Check this out. This is the new type of as it brute like a controller that I uh, designed. Very simple design. I removed some pieces of material to save some uh, PLA product filament. This is uh, pretty durable 
And let's take this one out if this one fits as well. Nice on my uh, fermenter. Let's lift the fermenter up. Here we go. This is the solid plate version. Very, already works pretty well. Fits like a glove, guys. Check this out. Pretty steady. And I will show you in a close up how it looks. Cheers to my controller holder. Guys, if you own a 3D printer yourself, I will make the design available for you guys. I will put a link in the more info section soon. And maybe I'm going to upload the design to uh, Thingiverse so it gets uh, globally available. Everyone will see it on that website, but if you're watching this video and you own a Brew Tech Conical Fermenter and you need a holder like this one, print it yourself. If you live in the Netherlands or somewhere in Europe and you like to have one printed, contact me and uh, we will see what happens and uh, how we can deal with the shipping, uh, etc. You can choose for the solid version or the version with some uh, splits in it. Well, I'm very happy. I just tried to make one of my own. Don't know if you can see it. Very simple design. But it works perfectly. Maybe when I have time enough I'm going to design one that you don't have to remove the wheels on it if you own them. So I make uh, some kind of a quick connect on it. But this is a very nice design I have to say. What do you think about it? Alright guys, thanks for watching. Speak to you all soon and remember nothing is better than a good homebrew. Cheers. Bye bye.